Elsa says, if you live together, but it doesn't move to marriage, do you consider that a committed relationship? Not necessarily. You can live. So committed relationship, there's only one thing that determines whether you're in a committed relationship. I mean, technically it's two, but there's one thing that's the most important thing that determines whether you're in a committed relationship. And that's if you've talked about it. It doesn't matter if you live together. I know people who have lived together and the guy only thought of her as a hookup, a, f a friend with benefits, right? And so you don't want to allow that to be your situation. You always want to talk about it. Always. If there's not an agreement that you're in a committed relationship, just assume that you're not in a committed relationship. It doesn't matter if you've met his friends and family. It doesn't matter if he's, you know, buys you gifts. He's taking you on vacations. It doesn't matter if you guys got a dog together. It doesn't matter if you bought a house together. If you haven't talked about it, just assume that you are not in a committed relationship. That's what you should do. You need to talk to men. You need to have real conversations with men about what they're looking for, where this is going, especially if you've been with a guy for a while, you deserve to know where this is going. And if he doesn't have an answer, that's an answer itself. And so you want to make sure you're having these conversations. So if you live together, but it doesn't move to marriage, do you consider that a committed relationship? Not if you haven't talked about it. Not if he doesn't consider it a committed relationship. You need to have the conversation, Elsa. Stop trying to avoid the conversations. Lots of women, they want to like look for clues. They're like, you know, detective. They're, they got their, you know, magnifying glass and they're like, oh, what's these clues? You know, I see this piece of string. Does that mean we're in a committed relationship? Oh, you know, he bought me a pair of shoes. Does that mean we're in a committed relationship? No. <laughs> no, it doesn't. It doesn't matter if he's taking you on vacation. All that matters is if you've talked about, I mean, that's one of the things you also want to consider whether he's acting like it as well.